Hi, I'm Glenn. I'm an advocate from Texas. I'm here at the Crossing in Mesquite with my pastor Charlie Brown, where we've held Compassion Sunday for the past five years. Why did I host a Compassion Sunday? Uh, for them. It was their big day, not mine. My main goal was just to raise awareness about compassion and show people how simple it is to get involved and really make a lasting impact on one of these precious little lives because it is the sponsor who speaks life and hope into these children. Well, Glenn is really the one who has promoted Compassion International for us. He's introduced it to us and he's the one who has the heart that really drives this ministry. But I'm excited about it uh, for a couple of reasons. One, uh, I, I have uh, sponsored a child. This is my child right here. Her name is Asha from uh, Tanzania, and I've had the privilege of watching her grow and hear her stories, uh, some of them heartbreaking stories. It's an encouraging thing to be a part of her life. We sponsor three children as a family. Sponsorship means a lot to me because uh, I am a former sponsored child. I was sponsored while I was in India, and I know for first hand um, how much impact it had in changing my life. I got good education and I got to know Jesus as my savior because I was sponsored. So I know how much sponsorship helps a needy child. This is my NG. Uh, she is my first sponsorship and has been my driving force. She has really inspired me to get involved and to sponsor more children. Uh, this girl has changed my life as a sponsor. But as a pastor, this is a very encouraging ministry to me because it allows virtually every church member to be involved in a missional way to make a connection with somebody in a different part of the world and support mission work firsthand and to hear the stories of those people from the individual that they're actually supporting. Hosting a Compassion Sunday is a neat experience because I can share my journey and my relationship as a sponsor with other church members and encourage them to sponsor a child as well. The greatest thing about our Compassion Sunday this past year is to see people getting up in the middle of the sermon and leaving as he was preaching so they wouldn't miss out on getting a child. I would recommend hosting a Compassion Sunday to anyone who currently sponsors a child and would like to share that experience with others. Um, my Compassion Sunday was a great experience for me because mostly because I'm not a public speaker. And I told God that I can't do this, I'm not a speaker. But it really helped to bring me out of my shell. I just did it very simply. Um, I, after a short video, I spoke for just a few minutes, and then my pastor finished off with a sermon on compassion and helping the needy. Um, I just had a small table set up and had enlisted the help of my good friend Stanley, who is a fellow sponsor and advocate, and not only for moral support, but just to help fielding the questions after. Um, he did a great job, and if you have someone who can help you like that, do not be afraid to ask them. Um, teamwork goes a long, long way in accomplishing the vision that you have for your event. Congratulations! If you are uh, hosting Compassion Sunday for the first time, you are doing something very important in the eyes of the Lord, and uh, you are accumulating a wealth of eternal treasures in helping other needy children being sponsored. I definitely recommend Compassion Sunday to anyone. It's just the simplest way to get others involved uh, with a cause that you're so passionate about. And knowing that you had a hand in changing the lives of these children is the most rewarding part. Uh, start with your home church if you can. That's what I did because it, there was less pressure that way. Um, everyone knew me and they didn't care if I was the most eloquent public speaker they had ever heard or not. You know, your home church is a great place because it allows you to be yourself and just be more relaxed. Um, more comfortable. So we pray that uh, your Compassion Sunday will go great for you and we'll be praying for you. But the best advice I can give is just do it. Just jump in for them.